the VA245 launch campaign started in the integration building, the bill, on September 6. After the stages assembly and the fluidic and electronical functional checks, the launcher was transferred to the final assembly building, the BAF, two weeks ago. The nominal planning has been adapted to take into account all the specificities of this single launch. Pepe Colombo is a totally atypical launch campaign carried out over six months at the Guyana Space Center. First of all, four Antonov aircraft brought the spacecraft's elements and equipment to French Guyana. In addition to these Antonovs, about 10 more containers arrived by boat. During the spacecraft preparation phase at the S5C payload preparation complex, Bebe Colombo occupied the two clean rooms configured as one large room. The spacecraft teams proceeded step by step to unload and install the spacecraft modules in the clean room, to integrate components onto these modules, to carry out electrical tests on the different modules, to meticulously install thermal insulation, which is carefully sewn by hand, and to check the different onboard propulsion systems of the modules. Solar panels were fitted onto each module of the spacecraft. We were all impressed by the solar panel deployment tests carried out across the huge structure built in the room. The filling of Bepi Colombo's different modules was carried out in between all of these operations according to a well-established schedule. After its preparation phase, Bepi Colombo was transferred to the final assembly building to be integrated onto the launcher. Once on the launcher, the finishing touches were carried out in the MOSIF, the sun shield was integrated onto the spacecraft. Everyone in the launch team is very proud to be part of this Bepi Colombo story. The spacecraft has been mated on the launcher last week and the launch vehicle is now ready for the rollout to the launch pad.